So we're in the vehicle heading up to Paradise, California, and you can see something even here, even off to the uh, left, still smoldering several days after the fire. Uh, it just looks like a, um, a wasteland out here now. Very sobering because you realize how many people lost their lives and uh, so many people still, uh, still missing. This is amazing. The fire was so hot it melted the beams of that building. Heartbreaking to see it all. Absolute total destruction. Unbelievable. Yeah, there are no cars here. You can see mainly just uh, utility and safety people. It's because it's still closed. We had to get through a checkpoint to get to this point uh, by the National Guard, which we appreciate all their safety. It's just a, a ghost town. No one here. No power, no water. So it's been just over a week and the owners have not uh, had a chance to come to their to their home to see if it's even still standing. There's still a lot of questions as to the status of people's homes, possessions, businesses. So we are heading up the drive to the church and the school, the Paradise Church and School, and there is the sign right there, and the sign is still standing. We heard many stories of heroism coming from of evacuating the students. I'm standing outside what once was the Paradise Avenist Academy. This is actually the elementary school that's behind me. Absolutely incredible destruction. It's amazing to me that uh, not long before this fire swept through and burned this school down, that there were children here in these classrooms. Just want to say thank you for your support for the disaster relief here in California. It's much appreciated.